Good afternoon. Um, that's Beaver Estate over there, Beaver Drive. One of the uh, biggest housing estates in Western Europe whenever it was built in the 1960s. Um, and I'm panning around and this is, I'm on the edge of actually Beaver Forest and some nice some nice oaks. One of the, in fact, the oldest oak, they reckon the oldest oak in the whole of Ireland is found about a mile away and I videoed it some time ago. It's, uh, it's in off the drive again. And it doesn't look too much like these boys. It's, uh, it is, it has fallen and uh, the, the tree is largely away, but it's still growing. It's still growing, but this is beaver forest, and it's an amazing place. It's the, as far as I know, it's the only commercial forest found within the city limits of any European city. It's not something. My goodness. And it's within walking distance of the city centre, and uh, people do avail of that. And we've got a new uh, sculpture here, and this sculpture is to celebrate trees. And it's uh, all been carved, and uh, certain words words have been put on it. Grow, shelter, deep, fort. I don't know what's it say up there. Earth, cups. Uh, I don't know. What does it say? Squirrels, future, wood. Roots. I don't know. A lot, of, a lot of words associated with with uh, forests, and this um, sculpture is to celebrate um, woods, trees uh, that shape our landscape and make it uh, so very much uh, more interesting, and actually uh, also give shelter to our woodland creatures and also our birds. And the weeds are just such a special place uh, to go, to take the dog for a run, to go for a, a jog, to check out the, uh, the bird life. And this sculpture is 15 feet high. It's of solid oak. And it was unveiled by the Woodland Trust's friend, Friends of Beaver Wood here in South Belfast. And there's going to be 11 of these handcrafted poles by um, a wood carver, Simon Clements, uh, situated in sites across the UK and Belfast has got one. Um, the sculptures are a physical and permanent legacy of the Charter for Trees, Woods and People, launched in November this year. The Charter for Trees, Woods and People was inspired by the original medieval charter of the forest which some 100, 800 years ago uh, reinstated the rights of everyday folk, everybody, everyday folk to access the royal forest. Isn't that good? Northern Ireland's charter pool represents the theme of planting, the importance of planning, greener local landscapes and uh, There you go, and we've got one. And if you come into Beaver for um, into Beaver Estate by the main entrance here of the dual carriageway up past Forest Side, um, and you come along the drive for about 50 yards, there's a turn off here. And you take that turn off, and you will find this uh, carved. Tribute to trees.
And it's another sculpture, a wooden sculpture this time that I have videoed. And Beaver Forest, Beaver Estate holds a lot of happy memories for me, I have to say. Uh, because I taught in Newton Breda High School just up the road for 30 years. Now Breda Academy, sadly. But nevertheless. Okay. <laughs>